55 Cancri E, also known as Janssen, is an exoplanet located in the constellation of Cancer, approximately 41 light-years from Earth. It is one of five known planets orbiting the star 55 Cancri A, which is part of a binary star system. Discovered in 2004, 55 Cancri E has intrigued astronomers due to its extreme characteristics and unusual composition. As a super-Earth, it is significantly larger and more massive than our planet, offering a glimpse into the diverse types of worlds that exist beyond our solar system. Five Cancri E orbits very close to its host star, completing one orbit every 0.74 days, about 18 hours. This proximity results in scorching temperatures, with average surface temperatures soaring to around 20,000 degrees C. Its discovery was made using the radial velocity method, which detects wobbles in a star's movement caused by the gravitational pull of an orbiting planet. approximately eight times that of Earth and a radius twice that of Earth. Its density of 5.5 g c Simther 3 suggests a composition that includes a significant amount of rocky material, likely composed of iron and silicates. However, the high temperatures mean that any surface rock would be molten, contributing to a hellish landscape of molten lava seas. Between Venus and 55 Cancri A would be an extraordinary event with dramatic consequences. mass of 0.85 m Earth and radius of 0.95 r Earth approaches 55 Cancri E, gravitational interactions would begin to affect both planets. The intense gravitational pull from 55 Cancri E would start to distort Venus's shape, creating massive tidal forces. impact, the kinetic energy released would be immense. Given the high relative velocities due to the proximity of 55 Cancri E to its star, the collision would release an energy equivalent to millions of nuclear bombs detonating simultaneously. Both planet surfaces would liquefy, resulting in a massive release of molten material into space. would likely create a transient debris disk around 55 Cancri E, composed of vaporized rock and molten material. This debris would eventually coalesce, either forming a new satellite or raining back down onto the planet's surface, leading to widespread volcanic activity and further heating. Over time, the collision would alter the planet's composition. The additional material from Venus would increase the mass of 55 Cancri E, potentially changing its orbit slightly. 
The atmospheric composition might also be altered, with gases from Venus mixing with those of 55 Cancri E, leading to a new equilibrium state. Cancri is a fascinating super-Earth, offering a glimpse into the diversity of planetary systems in our galaxy. Its extreme conditions and molten surface make it a unique object of study. Hypothetical scenarios, such as a collision with Venus, provide valuable insights into the dynamics of planetary formation and evolution, enhancing our understanding of the universe's complexities.